Alright. Random it. Alright, free win. Looks like we're tying the PB. Lenny B is so damn strong. It almost, almost makes you feel bad. With how free the winds are with it. You just FTL, FTL. Interesting choice, Mantis. Scrap before we get our second shield. Ugly pulsar, boo and hiss. Just so damn good. Down. Break that high. 
piloting. Shields two, engines two. Need a little more power for everything to be comfy. No bad man. Doors is fine. They're already refreshed, so I don't really need to do anything here. Don't need to kill them on board the auto scale. Up to thirty seven scrap. There really isn't anything. Here a fire. Breaches. all around. DNA bank for free. Love that. That is such good insurance. Think weapons buffer, make way for flak or heavy laser. Seven scrap, not a not really anything to do with it. So pass up the store. I want their stuff, I want them to give it to me now, so god damn it. Misclicking. Jolly's misclick adventures. will be ours. The, the thing with dead jumps, with, or empty jumps, with long-range scanners and 
sector updates. There's just dying the empty jumps. Alright, what's gonna have the free stuff is so it's gonna have double reward fights like aiding civilian ship or federation outpost. All that whatnot. Those are always empty beacons. Free crew, empty beacons. Basically, Zone Shield Bypass does a pretty good impression of it. Not giving fuel for missiles. I'll get missiles for fuel, but not the other way around. got for us absolutely nothing maybe this door will be a bit better yeah sell joint parts we want cloaking not hacking black one Lost my bio kill. Oh well. I'm gonna wanna find a training fight soon.
Force on. God damn it. I mean, if it wasn't for the sun here, this would be a training fight. Sounds like there's an anti-personnel drone as well, so we're gonna go ahead and take that nastiness down. Because Solar Flare to the Shield exists, so we're gonna break down their weapons. Slavers. Yeah, we'll train our pilot and engines here. I'm gonna go get a drink. I will be right back. Enjoy the FTL jams. Thank you for joining me this evening. Yeah, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere.
gonna be here in a bit, as, as usual, with two engines. But it's worth it. Sadly, we don't have single shot weapons or work to do to get training on the weapons. And everyone talks about how good Heavy Laser is, and it's just such a phenomenal weapon, it is true. One power for two damage in eight seconds is absolutely insane. But being a single shot weapon just makes it so good to get weapons training as well. You get basic can't hurt you like this, where you can't take any damage. When you have the right crew, or enough crew, then you're able to just get everyone fully trained, which just reduces the variance so much. And that's what you have to do with roguelikes. You gotta take things that are guaranteed. That's why hacking and cloaking are so good. Cloaking gives you guaranteed dodges. If you're not being hit, you're not taking damage, which means you're not wasting scrap on repairs. Then you're able to shove that all into upgrades. Hacking, you can hack weapons to not take damage, like with cloaking. You can hack shields to speed up the fight. Piloting or engines to also speed up the fight, depending on what projectiles you have. Oxygen, or med bay, if you're looking to get bio kills. Hacking is the most versatile system, it just does so much for you, and it's just... It's just that guaranteed stuff that makes those builds so strong. I personally value Guaranteed dodges. There's not... Because I mean, it, it all comes down to the drone surge and the super weapon with the flagship. Just being able to always dodge those or just be safe during them is just what makes cloaking so important. There's the non-cloaking runs where you're getting shields for and reddit engines. And even then, it's a nail-biter if you actually finish. Then there are times where you just get really good RNG and nothing ever hits you. And then you random into stealth B and die your first jump. Nineteen more dodges. We got one more jump before we exit. Dodge training is taking so long. They don't have anyone on weapons. Uh, yeah, we'll just 
see it. I'll show you later. that wants to live. I'm always trying to tell these pirates that, you know, if you really want to live, you gotta give me something else. You, you gotta give me a little, ex something a little extra. But they never seem to get it. But those, those guys definitely got it. are thinned as much as they can be for cloaking. Goalie missile. That's a boo. You're supposed to go away missile. You're supposed to go away forever. Probably the most agitating thing about breaking down the weapon system is when you see the missile go down, you think, yes, and then the other weapon fires and the missile comes back up. Just happened again. out of my bio kill. Do want a little bit of a fix up. Soul shield bypass, halberd beam, cloaking. A lot of good stuff there. You think your zone shield bypass? Door. You think your zone shield will protect you? You think your zone shield bypass will protect you? I have the zone shield bypass. Your zone shield doesn't protect you. Evil laughter. 
Nice, got it broken. Sounds like a fire got started, or that might just be the fire on my ship. Fire did get started. Contact with the enemy ship, please. Ah, loving the whips. Good spread. It's not right, spread. Bad spread there. We just jam along. Eight civilian ship. Clone the weaker guy on the ship. Be a flacking him. Sector 4, I think. I'm gonna wanna get his shields up. Both shields and. And engines. But we also are more desperate than ever for cloaking.
Need a store, need a store. And by a store, I do not mean ships with glaive beams. Didn't know I needed to clarify that. There's some stores. There's our cloaking. Some repair. Good night, Dad. Catch you later. Good missiles. Why is the NG in there? Why move the Lanius? See what's here, see if there's anything we want. There isn't. Lost a lot of jumps looking for the store though. So in border police. Everyone's favorite favorite event. Our clone bay. Raise me to the back of DNA bank. Start getting our engines up.
lot more scrap and don't take as much damage. Need 85 scrap for our third shield. Lost so many jumps looking for those stores. But we really needed cloaking being that late in the game. It's not good. down in time.
pretty random defense drum. Some more scrap. Which is what we want. That's the first bar shield training. Well, it's the crack drone. Got her full dodge training though. That's nice. Hopefully find another weapon. Murder. 
the backup battery now. We'll probably be able to get shields for this run. Wouldn't be surprised. Double burst laser 2, however, beam. Pretty scary. Also, it's the most annoying layout with a very annoying amount of crew. Uh, 
goddamn. Not accepting surrender. How the fuck did I get hit there? That does not make any sense. I call shenanigans. Killing the fucking human, thank you. Nah, there's doors. God damn it. Missile was down and then popped back up. Missiles. And looks like I shot. Shot the missile down.
can use the backup battery to power up it. Or I have Shield Spore, can use the backup battery to power up Engines 5. So we got full training on our shields, very nice. Oh my god, why the fuck are you guys all over the place instead of responding to the shields? Why is this guy in here with me? Go fix your shields!
not the greatest layout. And of course into the flagship here. Engine's hack is quite annoying.
Lanius repair jams. Fix up our clone bay, kill the boss, win the run. Just weather the first missile volley. So love a heavy laser right now, but oh well. Too bad I can't get a fire sword missile, it's very good. Kind of average score, bit low. 43 ships defeated, 88 beacons explored, 1692 scrap collected, 5 crew hired. Not too bad.